In this video, we're going to be talking about the history of Aldi Food Market. A store that I went to just yesterday to get a whole bunch of stuff for food. Well, my mom bought food, but we got food there yesterday. Anyway, you're probably going to ask yourself, why did they take this long to do a history video on Aldi? I actually did a history video of Aldi before, I believe. and But these repeat videos are actually just a little bit more better quality i look up more better information do more research on these stores so if you see repeat videos it's just that the other ones were kind of a little bit boring these ones are a little bit more better because i do more research on the history of these stores anyway let's get into all these all these dates back to 1961 when the first it was actually the first discount supermarket chain in the world it was founded in Germany back in 1961, and it's been in the United States for probably well over 40 years, I would say. All these used to have a big emphasis on having a lot of snacks, but now they have a little bit more better emphasis on having more fresher food. Something that they've just introduced only several years ago, updating their supermarkets with a little bit more fresher type of like signage and the aisles a little bit more wider than they used to be. The chain was founded by the Elbridge family in Germany in 1961, like I said before. And it was the first, like I said before, the first discount supermarket in the world. A lot of chains have followed and a lot of chains have failed, but all these seems to thrive on not failing and having a lot of stores open yearly. But you can't find all these in all 50 states though. You can only find it in 38 states with one or 2,152 locations scattered throughout the United States in 38 states. The first state to ever receive an Aldi in the United States was Iowa in 1976. That's when the first Aldi opened in the United States. The states with the most Aldi's is actually Illinois, and probably the state with the less Aldi's is probably Vermont or Arizona, where Arizona just has one Aldi, which is so, kind of strange that you think Arizona would have more stores, but like Aldi's, but they only have one or two. And Vermont has like maybe three or four locations. Getting back to Aldi's emphasis on new stores, this is what they look like now, and this is what they look like then. You can find all these used to be located within shopping centers, but now you can find them uh, on standalone locations. Thanks for watching this video.